my travel jewellery. Okay, so to start things off, it's not really jewellery as such, but I've got my uh, good luck prayer beads that I got when I was a kid, and I, I love these to bits. Uh, they're always with me. Um, I've got my fossil um, little jewellery kind of wrap zip up case thing. Um, it's quite robust um, and can easily contain all of my little gems, um, most of which are inexpensive little trinkets that I found on the way. Um, a lot of kind of uh, natural stones like malachite, that necklace, and a few other little bits and pieces. Um, I always find it's the best way to kind of jazz up an outfit while you're out, really. Um, taking basic kind of blacks and whites uh, can easily be transformed with little pieces like this tiny little Jorg Jensen um, charm that uh, was gifted from some friends of ours. I, I love it to bits. I think it's so sweet. It's really, really lovely. Um, looks great and just adds that kind of extra put togetherness about an outfit. Um, sipping that up, I've got my little compact mirror that my godmother gave me for my 16th birthday. It's like uh, vintage diamond cuts and um, proper vintage and uh, it has been battered now Monica it is safe to say but I love it a bit it's the sweetest little thing it folds straight into uh, your handbag and yeah I do love it one of my friends uh, Sunita got me this beautiful little um, coin purse I think it is from when she was away in Sri Lanka um, not Sri Lanka where is she now uh, Saint Lucia. Anyway, um, I fill it with all my little bobby pens and of course my tweezermans. Um, but yeah, I mean, can you ever really have enough of these? 